State lawmakers are considering a plan to track DUI offenders with a skin monitoring system that tests and alerts if they've been drinking. Action News' Samantha Manning finds out how they work and why some people are against the proposal. A transdermal device is already used in some cases here in Florida. The person wears it on their ankle just like this one. And if that person processes any alcohol, the device will detect it because of gases released from the body. You know, there's no question as to whether someone's drinking or not with this. Jessica Burdick with Court Programs of North Florida says the department already uses transdermal monitoring devices for some people out on bond and post-conviction sentencing. She showed me how the technology works by putting one on my ankle. It does a reading every 30 minutes to make sure that there's no alcohol in your system. Jessica says the data is uploaded daily or by the timeline assigned by a judge. Um, if someone were to take it off, we would get alerted to that, that it's been removed from the body. The proposal in the state legislature would allow courts to sentence DUI offenders to the use of these transdermal devices instead of an ignition interlock system. It's something the Jacksonville chapter of MAD, Mothers Against Drunk Driving, tells us they're against because transdermal monitoring devices can't stop someone from getting behind the wheel if they've been drinking. Some drivers we spoke with agree with MAD. I think the one that stops their car would be probably better. I think it would be good. The transdermal device can tell the difference from when you use a product with alcohol like Lysol compared to when you drink alcohol. Reporting on the South Side, Samantha Manning, CBS 47.